29th year of exhibitions, um, 10, 11 years for a part, um, and I'm really delighted to see you here today. Um, we had a preview last night with about three or four hundred people, so maybe that explains why we're a bit low on numbers today, but thank you for coming, and so far the weather is holding. Um, first of all, I would like to thank the team that has set this up in just over a week. Of course, Evelyn here is responsible for the placing and hanging. We did the sculpture trail about two weeks, um, but she always manages to place things so that sympathetically, and we hope that, um, that you agree that that works. Um, a part is very much a family affair now. Um, my son, Gareth, my daughter, Joyce, my sister Kay and my brother-in-law Ian and their partners Georgie and Cameron are very instrumental in um, putting the whole thing together. And that's a, quite a relief for me because it means I don't have to do quite as much as I did previously. Um, but my main task today is to um, welcome our guest um, artist, Soraya French. Um, Soraya has exhibited with us over the years, so we're really delighted that she's able to come today. And her work is on the um, display in the bay just over there. I could speak for a very long time about Soraya, but uh, I'll be brief and Thank you. hopefully to the point. Um, I know that um, some of you will almost certainly have been to her project workshop in Hampshire, where with her husband Tim, they um, do um, workshops, also your collection of, of art, and um, actually Tinks Newton, the um, arts editor of Surrey Life, was here yesterday, and she said she had a very enjoyable acrylic um, painting session with you. Um, Soraya is an artist, obviously, but she's also an author and a frequent um, writer for the magazine Artists. She's won various awards um, for, for her work and she is also the um, president of the Society of Women Artists. Former. 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 Okay, <laughs> right. And one of the nice things is that we have very many um, of the uh, Society of Women Artists actually exhibiting with us. Um, so that's re really special and certainly in the past Evelyn and I have been up to your exhibitions in the Mall and they've been of a very high standard indeed. Now we come to her painting. Well, I'm going to just move over here. I hope that isn't messing up Ian. But you can see what she really delights in, and that is bright colours, expressionism, and stories about everyday life, particularly from Africa. Um, so we've got two scenes there of um, Lake Sister, called Sisterhood, um, and I think her... Her work is, is really colourful and catches the imagination. So it is with great pleasure that I ask Soraya to say a few words and to officially open the exhibition. Well, thank you very much, Gwen. I really didn't expect that introduction. <laughs> um, so good morning, ladies and gentlemen, um, and welcome to App Art 2023. And as Gwen mentioned, uh, there has already been a very successful um, opening yesterday, um, a private view. Um, I would like to start by saying a huge thank you to both Gwen and um, Evelyn for inviting me today to say a few words and open this wonderful exhibition. Um, looking around this superb exhibition, it's no surprise that Apart has now become a much anticipated event, and not just in the diaries of the exhibiting artists, but also for many visitors to, to App Art who enjoy looking at art in a very warm and inviting um, atmosphere. The outstanding quality of the 2D work and beautifully displayed, I must admit, um, aside, it's the sculpture trail that really elevates um, effort for many of the visitors. It really is a magnificent um, experience. So 
take those umbrellas and go out there, please. <laughs> I know that the inclement uh, British weather doesn't always allow us to enjoy these things so freely. But the sculpture trade is a joyful experience and I'm certainly looking forward to going out there and visiting the sculptures. Now looking around uh, the exhibition this morning made me feel how art is truly a reflection of the world around us. And this exhibition is no exception. It encompasses a wide range of themes and perspectives, from the very personal to the universally relevant. It's a celebration of diversity as you look around you, highlighting many voices and experiences that make up a fantastic and great creative community like this. In my time, I've uh, create, curated a number of art exhibitions over the years, some of them on a much smaller scale than this um, for our local art group, um, for my children's school when I was a member of the PTA. And in recent years, also as the president, former president, I should say, of the Society of Women Artists. So I really appreciate the hard work involved. This exhibition, as Gwen mentioned, really is the culmination of countless hours of hard work dedication and passion by this formidable team, that is Gwen <laughs> and Evelyn Phillips, plus the family. So this year's exhibition is a true family affair. And I would like to extend a vote of gratitude on behalf of all the artists and the visitors alike um, for creating this amazing platform each year to showcase our works. Now I encourage you to take time to fully immerse yourself in the art on display and to contemplate the meaning and the significance the artist wishes to communicate. If you've brought young visitors with you, um, please encourage them to engage with the broader conversation that the art may spark. And I hope that Art 2023 will be an inspiring experience for you all. I also hope that for any shy and modest budding artist out there today, um, this exhibition acts as a catalyst to encourage them to start taking part in the exhibitions. So be pleased, finally. <laughs> I hope that this morning we can set aside all the worrying news we are bombarded with on a daily basis and enjoy this exhibition and in the words of the great man himself, Picasso, let art wash away from your soul the dust of everyday life. Thank you. I will say the final word. Thank you very much for coming. And thank you very much, Raya. I've admired your work tremendously over the thank last, you. well, really 20, 20 years you've been exhibiting with me. But uh, yeah, this year is, is like with anybody. We think, oh God, this year will it be all right? But it's, it's absolutely fine. And I think, like Soraya said, go on the trail. It's fantastic, but the work here on this place is this year so colorful and so joyous. So enjoy it and perhaps enjoy it more at home. So uh, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, enjoy. We've got coffee and tea and biscuits and uh, please help yourself. We've got people on the desk there who can help you make it. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. We right. officially <laughs> announced this exhibition open oh, now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.